In order to run that command, I'll simply type in create users. So the moment I type in create users, so you can see here, all the 10 users are successfully created. In this video, I'll show you how we can create multiple users in Windows PC on one single click. I'll just show you, suppose these many users we want to create, 10 users and their password. Now, for example, so in order to create the user in Windows, the command that we'll be using is net user and then inverted comma will be there and within inverted comma, the username will be there. So if I type in username, it will be, for example, Amjad is the username. So password is again, for example, one, two, three. And then we have the forward slash, and then it is called app. So in case you want to add the user, so you will do like this. And if you want to read the user, so you will type in the similar command. And here, instead of add, you will type in delete. So these two commands are to create the create the user or delete the user. So here we will see how we can create this command using the formula. So I'll be typing in here net user and so I'll type copy these all commands and I'll type in notepad. Here you can see these many users will be created. I'll just simply save the command, save the, save the file as it will be create users.pat. And in case I want to just make sure that the users are created, here one inverted comma is missing. So I save this file. Now I'll be running the command here. I'll go into command prompt again and right click and run as administrator. Now here I need to open the directory uh, cd space users, cd space my user and then cd space desktop. So it will have all my files which are there. You can see here create users.bat is there. In order to run that command, I'll simply type in create users so the moment i type in create users so you can see here all the 10 users are successfully created now if i go back here again and i refresh this if i see this here other users you can see these many users are created if i want to delete the users i'll simply go back again to the same file in the notepad open and i'll be opening the same bat file again so here I'll replace add with delete so I'll simply type in h and instead of add I will delete so all the commands are now changed so you can see delete but I need to remove this section also which is now you can see here these many users will be deleted so I'll simply again run the same command so you can see here all the users 10 users that we created are deleted now so these users were existing there so i'll just go back again here and look for other users so you can see here all the other users are deleted so this is the way you can create and delete the user from the list which is provided to you in case the list is in the excel format or the list comes from the database to create the users in the system without going through various actions so you can simply type in the command and just create the user so hope you like this video see you in next video take care and goodbye